This is the cheapest Nissan Leaf in the UK. Back in summer, Rory did a range test and achieved a heady 66 miles. But what if you're someone like me and likes to drive flat out everywhere? Which got me thinking, how quickly can I drain the battery on Rory's car? So today, we're gonna to be doing an Autobahn range test. <laughs> you, you all right? Yeah, you all right? Yeah. Can I have the key, please? Yes, I will give you the keys because I am curious how far this car can go when driven fast, but be careful. No. Fine, I'm coming with you. Yeah? Before we do go though, let's place some bets, okay? You did 66 miles driving very economically. I'm gonna be doing the opposite. What do you reckon we're doing? Mm, I'm gonna go 25 miles. Oh, Dan on camera. 33 miles. 33. 33. GP? 29. 29, okay. 29. What, are you, what are you saying? I wanna beat you, I'm gonna go 24. 24. All right. <laughs> It's you like are? a red rag to a bull. Yeah. All right, let's do it. You haven't been it. for a poo today, have you? <laughs> right, let's go. Well, you didn't say yes or no. The objective here is simple. We all know that manufacturers claim electric cars can go really far, but their range tests are usually done with a mixture of driving. Some slow, some fast, some stopping and starting, and at a variety of speeds. The tests are usually not carried out in adverse weather like we have today, with temperatures as low as minus three degrees. So, what's the worst case scenario for EV range if you're in cold weather, which they really don't like, and if you're going flat out on a road that allows it, like the Autobahn? So this is it? This is it, mate. This right. is the Autobahn. Well, the Autobahn in Britain. Um, can you give me a quick reading of your range? Yeah, range says 42 miles, Rory. Okay, that's in eco mode. Yeah. All right. We don't um, want to do eco mode, do we? We don't. Let's get get into full drive. Right. Full I'm... power. Oh, there we go. Okay. Right. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna go for it. Can we also have some demist on, please? Yeah. Go on. Demist. Oh, right. Active. Yeah. And some heat. I need some heat. Heat. We enabled. Are... Oh God, we're we're actually doing big speed here. 85, 87. Oh, 89, 90, 90 91, 92. 92. 94, 94, 95, 96, 97, 97. I thought you said this had a top speed of 89 miles an hour. 99 miles an hour. We're doing 99 miles. Oh my God. Oh, so we have gone down to 24 miles and we have done 3.1 miles. Okay, how's she handling? How's she holding up? Oh, beautiful. I, didn't That's you right. tell me today that if you let go of the steering wheel, it will steer itself? Not in this lane. Not in this lane. Not in, so do what? not, no, no, do not. What about lane go. five? Can I lane, go in lane five? Lane five is closed. Oh, <laughs> so don't go is into it lane actually five. closed yeah, properly? Yeah, it's actually, yeah. Okay, we're down to 98 miles an hour, 21 miles. That's brilliant. Do you know what? At 97, 98 miles an hour, it actually feels quite nice. It's quite good, isn't it? It's a nice car to drive. It is very comfortable. The wind noise is quite Horrendous. low as well. <laughs> That's not too bad. We are, we are maintaining 99 miles an hour though. That is there absolutely we go. The, the crazy. The horn's going. <laughs> Let's see if that does anything. Oh, we've got a battery light on. Okay, battery level is low. Oh, we're down miles. to three miles. What? <laughs> How has it gone down to three miles? <laughs> this is going to be a very short video. <laughs> Two miles remaining. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what? You were maybe right. Off camera, Rory said to me, Oh man, I think it's going to do eight miles. I was like, nah, yeah. you're, you're off your rocket. It's going to do at least 20. We've done five miles. It's down to one, one mile remaining. Mile. Oh my God. And we're down to 90 miles an hour. It's losing power. Do you know what, Alex? I, <laughs> I thought we'd be here a bit longer at first. So I, I actually bought snacks. I bought some crisps. Oh mate, I'm always happy to eat. Uh, mince pies. Oh yeah, let's have a mince, want a mince pie. pie? Oh, let's have a mince pie. You've got to have a mince pie when you're doing a range test. Yeah. You're gonna to have to feed it to me though, Rory. <laughs> because I've got to keep two hands on the steering wheel. You've got to concentrate. Yeah. All right, there's your mince pie. There you go. I can't, I can't hold just it. Chew, just chew it. <laughs> oh, they're horrible. These are frozen. Those? Where are you getting those from? <laughs> Speaking of frozen. Yeah. It's currently minus one degree out. It is. So worst case scenario for an EV is cold weather and high speed. I've also got a uh, smoothie. Do you want a smoothie? Oh yeah, I've got it then. I'll feed it to you, yep. <laughs> Is that right? Mm. Yep, good. Mince pie and smoothie, my <laughs> favourite. <laughs> Just a lot of fruit, it's healthy. Yeah. It's do you know what we should do? Should we, try and, should we try and rinse the battery a bit more? Turn the headlights on. 
Yeah, I'm also... Wipers are on. Wiping the windscreen. Shall I turn the hazards on as well? Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. There you go, hazards. Windows down. Windows down. Oh! <laughs> you know the flap at the front? Yeah. To, uh, to charge it. What about no. if we open it no. for extra drag? No, because it's going to fly up, hit the windscreen and possibly de decapitate us. But Don't do all, that. All, all look, all, 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 it's, look it's, it's, it says it's lost. It's battery not, level is low. Okay, battery level is, yeah, it's oh, not. It's kind of backing off and then giving me a bit more, but we're still doing 97 miles an hour. That's impressive. That is very impressive. My foot could not be more buried. I'm going to turn the heating up to max. Oh, it is up to maximum. Yeah. What else can we do? Oh, oh, oh. You doing that actually slowed the car down. Really? Yeah. Can I just say, this is not the way you're supposed to drive a Nissan Leaf <laughs> or any car for that matter. Well, there are some brands in which this is perfectly acceptable. <laughs> BMW. No, I, no, you cannot say that. <laughs> no, you get in trouble if you say that. You can't say that. <laughs> right. It's holding up 94, it 93. Is. 92. It's not showing us a range estimate anymore. Yeah. So what this goes to prove is if your Nissan Leaf says that there is no battery, you just need to carry on driving at over 90 miles an hour. Yeah, floor it. Yeah. With the wipers on. Yeah, and the horn. Are you good? There we go. Is there anything else we can do? There's no heated seats. What about if we were to open the door for a bit of drag? <laughs> no, no, I'm definitely not opening the door. We'll get banned from Milbrook. But we're on the autobahn. Just say, <laughs> sorry, it was an accident. <laughs> what do you mean, but we're on the autobahn? Who does that on the autobahn? You never done that. <laughs> I can't say I have, mate. <laughs> We're still doing 94 miles an hour. So on the screen it says very low battery charge level. Do you want to search for a nearby charging station? No. Things were going well then, but soon I began to notice a strange smell. Can you smell burning? Is that the motor or the heating? No, no, we'll find out. I'm not going to stop though. All right. Thanks, mate. So this was, what, capped to 89 miles I an thought, hour? I thought, I read on the internet, it will do a maximum of 89. Oh yeah, I mean, you can always believe everything you read on the internet, can't you? But I can now no longer really see because the wipers go, so I'm going to switch those off. Right, okay. Do you have any more snacks? I do have more snacks. What else can we do to sap the battery? How about if we just pull on the electric window? Oh yeah, draw switches. some current yeah. there. What about the hatch? No. We're not opening the hatch. Okay, what's the minimum speed or the maximum speed we're allowed to do that? Uh, we're not We're not doing it at all. We're not taking our foot off the What about 70? No. What sits? No. Or sensations? Sensations, always sensations. Gotta be sensations, isn't it? Do you know what? I bought the what sits for you and the sensations for me. Really? Yeah. I thought we were a what sits guy. No. God, what much do you think of me? Not much. Ah! <laughs> Touch me. <laughs> It's still going at 93 <laughs> miles an hour. 16.9 miles driven. Do you want to know anything about your car? You haven't no. asked me a question I about my I beautiful leaf. I actually don't care. You don't want <laughs> How much did you pay for it? I paid £4,695. And uh, right now, do you know how much it's worth? Leafs are going for? Two grand. £4,500. Really? Which, yeah, yeah. But no, that's at the bottom level. I've seen them selling on Autotrader for around six grand. So I reckon, I, well, I've definitely not lost money. I might have actually made money on this car in a year. Yeah, not after this test. No. I think after this, we've probably completely ruined the battery. Also, what is this battery level indicator on the right? And why don't I have full? What does that mean? So that's the health indicator. That shows you the state of the battery health. It's 12 bars when the battery is totally healthy, but over time the battery degrades and you lose some capacity. So we've lost about 33% capacity from the battery. Yeah. Originally it was a 22 kilowatt hour battery pack, 22 kilowatt hour net, which is the usable capacity. But by losing a third, I think it's down to about 16 kilowatt hours. Yeah. I did 66 miles on 16 kilowatt hours, which means I did about four miles per kilowatt hour. Um, I'd be interesting to see what kind of miles per kilowatt hour we're going to get at the end of this test. I don't think it's going to be anywhere near four. It might be closer to, well, it's more than one. Yeah, it's doing all right. It's one it? point something. It's 19 miles we've done. You're down to 85 now. What I've... happens if I, is, has it got cruise control? Yeah. Is it doing it? Yeah. Cruise oh, control. Oh, that's nice. Can you set it to 90? I can set it to 87, 88. Oh, 88 is the maximum. Okay. That's like back to the future speed. But we're doing 79. We are now slowing down. We are losing oh, power. Oh, 
Battery what level happened? is like, I'm going to have to go through the, I don't know if the cruise control is glitching, but that was a big... Motor power is limited. We've done 20 miles. That's crazy. <gasps> now the race is on. Who wins? Yeah. Is it going to be me at 24? Is it going to be you at 25? Or is it going to be the camera guys? Oh, oh no. Oh dear. Oh, you're losing power. 63. Yeah, this is this is all she's got. 60. I'm actually going to have to go into lane two. Oh, I think we're, yeah, we're slowing down. We are slowing down. <clears throat> Come on. 56. 37. I'm getting re I actually really want it to stop now because I'm so hot. No, it's still going. I'm going to keep going. We need to slipstream the camera car. Have you actually got power? Or... This is foot flat to the floor. Okay, lift off a bit and, and, and see if it will let you accelerate. If you've got no power, we'll pull in. Right. Is it, if it's not accelerating, right, let me, let me, let me it's in neutral, pull in, it's in neutral. I don't want it in pull neutral. It. No, no, it, that means it's dead, that means it's dead. That means it's dead. Neutral means it's dead. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> that is it. How are the brakes? They're quite good. A little bit of regen there. Does that mean we can keep going? No, we wait, are, that wait, is wait, it. Wait, wait. That is it. Wait, let me, let's just switch this off. Wait. <laughs> 21.6 miles though, that means I won. You did win, didn't you? I did. You did. I thought, oh, honestly, I thought we'd get way less. You said eight. Off camera, I said eight. Yeah. But no, it's, it's done all right. Yeah. Flat out. Yeah. It's a good job you don't do like new cars or electric cars because you, you you have no clue about yeah, electric really car, car range, do you? <laughs> so we have the result. 21.6 miles when driven flat out at speeds of nearly 100 miles an hour showing, in no uncertain terms, as if anyone had any doubt, that driving very quickly can drastically affect not only your fuel economy in a petrol car, but also your range in an EV. Naturally, this was just a bit of fun. Driven sensibly, a 10-year-old Leaf can manage 66 miles or 4 miles per kilowatt hour, but your absolute worst-case scenario is 0.7 miles per kilowatt hour. All that was left then was for Alex to help me get the Leaf back to my house. But since it's not possible to tow an electric car, it would have to be loaded onto his trailer. Only one slight problem though. I don't think it's a neutral. Hang on a minute, it won't, it won't pop out of a uh, handbrake. The handbrake won't go off. Oh dear. Is it that out of battery? Have you got the key on you? No. I'm going to have to Google how to get a Nissan Leaf out of handbrake. It's not doing it. Oh, crying out loud. I know, I, I know what to do. Have you got any, you got any tools? Why, what's happening? Are you going to disconnect the battery? We're going to disconnect the 12 volt battery. If we kill that, it should kill all the electrics, including the electronic handbrake. Genius. What website told you this? <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, so now by your reckoning, now it should the just parking roll. Yeah, the parking brake is deactivated. Oh, it's because we're on an incline. Maybe Didn't. if you push it the other way. Oh dear. Can you go, can you go to Argos and buy yeah. a generator? I'll, I'll do it right away. <laughs> I'll let, yeah. well, let me just unstrap. I'll give you back your mic and then I'll, I'll be back in half an hour. Yeah. How about that, yeah? You're not going to be back, are you? No.